Hey guys, so in this video we'll be looking at how you can convert string value to a decimal number. So in Automation Anywhere A360, basically you have a package uh, string and number data type. Okay. So, um, but the issue with the number data type is it it don't take decimal values. Uh, basically, while converting the string value, suppose here I have taken 3.14 uh, as a value of pi and string variable okay now we want this string value to be converted into number so the package which uh, says two number doesn't directly convert 3.14 uh, into a number it will it will truncate the decimal value so let me show you this by putting a message box over here and displaying the number directly so in order to display a number you need to uh, I basically uh, write this and dot to string. Basically, we need to again convert this into to string variable so that it gets printed. Okay, so num str number. Uh, sorry, uh, it's converted to number so num by dot to string. So let let me run this and show you um, how the num how the decimal part is getting truncated, and then I'll show you the fix for that, or maybe the proper step how you can um, convert a string into a number, decimal number basically. So let's get the bot is running, downloading the dependencies. Okay, so as you can see, uh, we didn't get the decimal part of this, right? Which is incorrect over here. I'll stop the bot for now and we'll proceed with the solution. So I'll disable this. And now, what what you can do is, if you if you need to convert dot, uh, if you need to convert a string value into a number, what you can do is. You can first try to convert it into a number, but first try to hold that value in a number variable, num, uh, in a variable of type number, and then uh, you can convert it again to a string. So then, this number by variable, I need to convert it again to a string uh, variable with providing the number of digits you want. So basically, if your number is 3.14, here the number of digits can be two. If you provide three, that is uh, uh, the bot will directly uh, add zero, append zero over here. Okay, and then uh, you can like here we will go with three, and we'll see the value. And at the end, I have just added one condition to check the value if it is greater than. 2.50 so I'm checking two decimal values in this condition so let's run this now you will be able to see the entire thing entire flow of the bot we're just assigning 3.14 in a string then converting that string to a number then uh, converting that number back to string with decimal uh, values with, with decimal places so this is the correct way of uh, of comparing or converting a num string to a number. So you see, this is a proper comparison. So that's all, guys, for this video. If you like, uh, please comment your thoughts. And if you have any other work around or suggestions, feel free to suggest that. Thanks.